Hello everyone and welcome back to New Tech. Today we're going to show you how to connect your Redmi Watch with Xiaomi Wear and Android. To download the app, you can search Xiaomi Wear or you can scan the QR code that is in the watch. You can see we don't have any device now that a new update came and you can press add new device and search for the redmi watch which is in the bottom of the page when you press it it will start to search for the redmi watch and it will start to connect pair and add account you can see that we have three steps and the first time that i did this at the third step it failed on me you can see right now in the video how it will fail for, uh, right now and i just press try again you can see at the second try it asks to pair it's even though it's in chinese i know that the right side is to accept press accept in the right side and now as you can see it says paired and the watch it becomes in english which is a good thing so we don't have to do anything else to turn it in english from chinese this is all that we have to do now the watch is connected we are able to use all the options that we have here so back at the first page you can see it says connected it's sizing all the data we have the cords which where we can add cords to pay with you can see we have here the skill center which is all in chinese but i think these are just inst instructions we have the notifications which we have to allow first in the settings you can see how i'm allowing it when you turn on you can go and scroll through your apps and activate as many apps as you want if you want all of them i'm just going to activate the google chrome facebook instagram these type of stuff that i always use you can see after a couple of things that you allow you will get notifications later we have here incoming calls alert and show contact information that i'm allowing both of them we have the user guide in case you need anything background activities additional settings you can see we have the manage widgets signs weather check for updates and we have about device or unpair at the bottom here at the top now the app is signs we have the band display so we can change the faces of the band in just the matter of seconds you can see how immediately it changes the watch face or we can download more as you can see at the online shop these are all free you just have to download them as many as you want let's try one of these these looks pretty good so this is the one that we are downloading today it will take a couple of minutes and probably it depends a little bit on your wi-fi speed so be patient and wait until it's done you can see how it's downloading and after it been downloaded it signs itself you can see how good it looks this new uh, face as i said you have plenty of them don't worry you can download as many as you want and it won't take too much space these are the options that we have for faces online let's get back and see what we got next at the second page we have the activity for today as you can see we have the january 30th we can change the date and see for example in day before what we did for heart rate steps again we have the heart rate data stand up time statistic sleep statistic and this is all that we have in the second page in the third page as you can see these are mostly in chinese but these are the plans that you do for sports you can activate a sport from the third page in the fourth page as you can see we have my awards personally data privacy weekly report you can see we have here a page full in chinese which i don't understand unfortunately we have personal information feedback settings in the settings we will find new messages and we will find a couple of settings to change and we have the third party login here you can see the notification how it will work 
So guys, this was all for today's video. I hope you find this video interesting and helpful. If so, hit the like button, subscribe to our channel, and we'll see you in the next video with another smart device.